one of the skills that sets apart good leaders from great leaders is their ability to convey empathy. It's not always that they are actually empathetic, it's the fact that they convey empathy, and empathy is a skill that you can build. And you hear many stories of people who meet great people who come away feeling really encouraged because that person conveyed empathy. So there are three skills you need to master to be able to convey empathy. The first of those is to listen to people. And the secret that I've learned to convey empathy as you are listening is to think about listening with your eyes and your heart, not just with your ears. Really look at people, really seek to understand them, really seek to ask what moves them. So often when we meet people, we say to people, what do you do? But really a better question to ask is, who are you? What do you enjoy? And so we have to learn to build empathy through the way that we listen. The second thing we need to learn to do is to, and this is strange, is to practice meditation. Not some ooh-ah, wonderful, uh, strange kind of way of meditation, but spending time contemplating others and contemplating the good for others. Research shows us that if we just spend short amounts of time contemplating good happening to other people, we become more empathetic. We actually desire for other people to have good happening, and so we come across in the way that we convey ourselves to them. And the third thing we can do to increase our empathy is to expose ourselves to new ways of living, meeting new people, traveling, uh, going to new restaurants, all of those things help expose us to a way of doing life that's a little bit different than what we might normally do. And that increases our ability to be empathetic for people. So, you don't always have to feel empathy, but as a leader, you need to display empathy. Do that through listening, meditation, and exposing yourself to new practices.